they want to finish the Nuba. That's what they are aiming. They want to finish them. What they did in, in Darfur is happening now in new mountains. A lot of people are displaced, no food, no medicine. So it is tragedy, what is happening there now. We can't turn back the clock on the genocide in Darfur. But we can stop history from repeating itself today in South Kordofan, where the same brutal leader, President Bashir of Sudan, is targeting the Nuba people. In Sudan, we learned that as many as one million people are threatened by the government's brutal assaults. It is, it is bad. The situation is bad. Burning houses, burning churches. Now start searching house to house. When they found a family inside that house, they don't even shoot them. They slaughtered them. They slaughtered the whole family. They started bombing them because there is no way by road. And then uh, they just uh, drop these things randomly, where there's civilians, there is whatever, cows, cattle, you know. If I think that what's happening now in Luba Mountain, really, it is um, ethnic cleansing is taking place. Uh, crisis that is in in South Korea to find today cannot be you know cannot be ignored. We need the the, the government of the United States of America and the international community to put more pres pressure on this government of the Northern Sudan. We must stop history from repeating itself. We must. <laughs>